In today's video, if I pull a foil, I must open a vintage pack. What's up guys, we're back with another redemption video and you might be asking, what does this have to do with redemption? If you recall the last time we did this, about three to four weeks ago, go check out that video if you guys missed it. I made a slight mistake. So the premise of these videos is if you pull anything over a guaranteed super rare or a foil in one where it doesn't guarantee a super, you're supposed to open a vintage pack. Well, we did that until the end where I pulled a foil and didn't notice. I'm tracked with the aqua mirror. Karakuri Cash Shed. I went right past the Kurakuri Cash Shed or something like that, and you could barely tell it was a super. So I was like, okay, that's the last pack. We should have opened another pack. So we are redeeming ourselves here today by opening a bunch of different epic packs. And if we pull anything, we'll be opening a vintage pack by rolling a die one through six. We'll pick this. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and that'll give us a random pack to open. And of course, if you pull one out of the vintage pack, like last time when I pulled one and didn't notice, you still have to open another vintage pack. Before we get into it, we do have a giveaway. I'll be giving away these cards. So we we have the Legend of Blue Eyes First Edition, Metal Raiders First Edition, and Feral Servant. These are opened packs. We opened these in a video recently, and the guy who actually sent me these to open said, hey, just do a giveaway. I think people will like it. So yeah, he's right. These are first edition rares and comments from these sets. So the Legend of Blue Eyes stuff is actually worth quite a bit. If you want to enter the giveaway, just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications. Just let me know if you can forgive me for my mistake last time. Let me try to redeem myself here. Myself. Selves. I'm not myself, I'm myself. Let's do that. All right, let's start it off with Legendary Duelist Rage of Raw. So this is not a guaranteed foil pack. So if we pull any super rare or anything like that, that will be a vintage pack we have to open. If it's nothing, then we just move on to the next pack. We have Mind Control, Mechlord Army. I think it's the next one. I think it would be in the fourth slot. And then Cyber Energy Shock. So we didn't get anything there. As I said, not guaranteed. And this one though, Flames of Destruction, this does have a guaranteed super. So a super will not count as a foil because they're guaranteed every time. We should find a better name for that. Just like a, I just basically just a non guaranteed pull. I just say foil because it's universally understandable we'll do three we have alter guys uh yeah but some people comment on the last one like yeah you should have to do it for supers i'm like well it'd be a never-ending video then you know there's not really a, a reward for like pulling something because we would pull it every time there was a super so it wouldn't really be that interesting battery man solar we have element saber malo restoration of monarchs goki octo stretch nightmare service actually a really good super it's guaranteed but a great one that's a good super and uh yeah so not a vintage pack but actually a very solid guaranteed super rare pretty good card all right next pack we have some battles of chaos first First edition you know there's double chances here because there's dark magician potentially there's also starlight potential regular foil potential super rare guaranteed every pack so keep that in mind epsilon there's a super so it doesn't count but that's okay because could get the dark magician at the end of the pack some org we have Ogdoidic and a ghost trick festival just a regular rare so not in that one but maybe in the next pack so far we have not pulled a foil so we haven't had to roll the die yet to open an epic vintage pack but I suspect that it may be coming soon. I assume it's one, two, three on this. Can we get Firewall Dragon? Treasure Panda, cool card for uh, Exodia. On, was it Duel Links or Master Duel? I can't remember. I think it was Master Duel. Begging by the World Chalice, the Go Go Arista Dexia. Chosen by the World Chalice, World Chalice Legacy. Our Landmark, we have Boogie Trap. Is that a super? No, it's not. Motivating Captain, it should be after this. Oh, I thought that was a secret for a second. Okay, DDD Wave, High King Caesar. Our DDDs were actually kind of expensive for a while. I think it was after pack, like one something with them or something. Battles of Chaos, can you give us a double? If we get two foils in a pack, then we'll open two vintage packs. So we've got like Dark Magician and a foil. Eurodora Fate, Ghost Trick Siren. We have Darton, the Mechanical Monstrosity, and a Vampire Ghost, our first foil that is not a super rare it's an ultra rare so it's not guaranteed that will open a vintage pack for us now we can get a dark magician it's a double vintage pack here we go my tint mutant it's usually the last card no s force laps well that's okay because we did finally get something that's going to help us open up a vintage pack so here's where we roll the die one to six let's go let's see what we get three okay so that means we're opening legacy of the valiant so not a crazy old set but over 10 years at this point let's see if we can pull a ghost rare this is kind of a weird set like not a lot of amazing cards but it does have ghost rares and ultis in it which is pretty exciting first is ghost trick neko masume gorgonic guardian actually a very good exceeds card uh sire norka we got a uh, chronomaly moi carrier the magio sheldon we got sheldon okay gorgonic gargoyle the, oh, I'm not even going to try to say that, Mystical Beast of the Forest, Sylvan Peacekeeper, love to see that, and 
XC's override. So no foil out of that. The Peacekeeper though is pretty fun. We're gonna replace that one with a Cross Souls. So if we do roll that spot again, we'll open a Cross Souls. Next up, Breakers of Shadow Bosch. So it's a pretty cool set, but unfortunately back then they did not have, you know, Starlight Rares or anything really awesome to pull out of here. So some cool cards, but their Secret Rare is the highest rarity. Robot Buster Destruction, but supers are guaranteed as well. So it's a very small thing. It's like you're guaranteed a super, but you can only pull a couple things better than that. Ultra and Secret. So kind of weird, a weird time in Yu-Gi-Oh. Not a, my favorite in terms of like the pack structure. Oh, a Cosmo Sword Troopers, that's guaranteed. And then Odd Eyes Advent. So that's just a super rare. Yeah, these Cosmos, definitely not inspired by anything. Definitely not. They look completely unique. Now we have Dark Neo Storm. We'll probably pull a Fusion Destiny now, you know, now that it doesn't matter. It is guaranteed supers, and that's a super rare, but those were pretty, pretty big. They're like 20 bucks for a while. Valkyrie Chariot. We have a Dino Wrestler Marshall Enga, the Ice Miyakashi, Goki the Blade Ogre. Ultra Geist, Dragvirion, the Firewall Guardian, TG Hopper Cannon Assault Mode. Uh, and a number five, Doom Chimera Dragon with a Tyrant Dino Fusion. So a guaranteed super rare in that one. Okay, we need we need some foils. We've pulled one so far. Last time it started a little slow, and then we pulled a bunch at the end, and then one that I didn't even notice. So yeah, they, they can heat up at the end. Cybernetic Horizon, not a crazy set, but it does have some Cyber Dragon stuff, which is cool. World Legacy, we've got Crusadia Leonis. Beast Magic Attack, Contact Gate. Metaphys Ascension, Crusadia Maximus, another super, then a Ruin Supreme Supreme Queen of Oblivion, Cool Retrain, and Performer Pal, Label Man. He's a Label Man. Will Rage of Raw be what changes everything? If we pulled a Ghost Rare, I mean, open a vintage pack and get the Ghost Rare, that would be amazing. Mechlord Astro Dragon Asterisk. We have Mechlord Emperor Skiel, Brain Control, and Holding Legs, just a regular rare. No. Okay, it's okay. Battles of Chaos, multiple chances. Could have a double vintage pack coming here, guys. We need you guys to believe in the comments. Let's go. Send me some luck. One, two, three. I think you can do four. No, wait, we're not doing it because of the Dark Magician. Okay. You know what we could do? We could go. This could be the Dark Magician. So we go three like this and then do that. So we have back-to-back -back chances there. Dynamorphia Diplos, Dynamorphia Alert, Flower Dino, Tribe Drive, Obinamaru, Onibamaru. There we go. Soul Sweeper, the Branded Disciple, Kaiza the Hidden Star. Libra Mancer Agent, it's a super rare, that's guaranteed. And Ogdoidic Serpent Strike, so still looking, guys, still looking. We have another Legendary Duelist Rage of Raw. Just kind of threw these in there randomly, so they're kind of coming up. This is about two out of three uh, Rage of Raw, but maybe that means there's going to be a Ghost Rare right here. Psychic Shockwave, let's go. Metal Reflex Slime, a uh, good reprint of that card, though. It was actually really expensive for like the regular, I think it's an Ultra before that, so good reprint. Battles of Chaos, I think it's our only hit so far in Battles of Chaos, so do that. That fun pack trick, we have Groza, the Tyrant of Thunder. Smile Potion, we got Mutant Mutant, the Ghost Trick Shot. Dimension Conjurer, End of the Line, Pot of Greed, Branded Disciple. We have a White Relic of Dogmatica, Super Rare, and AS Force. Lapswell. I feel like it always ends with the same cards in Battles of Chaos for some reason. Okay, we really need to pick it up because we have one foil so far. We have Judgment of Light. It was actually kind of an older pack, but it was unlimited, so I threw it in the stack. We could get a Chicolates out of here, which would be pretty epic. Junk Blader. Trap Tricks. Nepithins. Something like that. Fencing Fire Ferret. Oh, that's a Ruxin special. We got a Shark Caesar. Brotherhood of the Fire Fist Caribou. And is this it? Umbral Horror Uniform? Wait, are these? Oh, these aren't guaranteed, I don't think. Mecha Phantom Beast. Wabuloran and Spell Recycle. Yeah, not guaranteed foil there. Yeah, that's how old that one was. Okay, okay, don't worry. This is it, guys. Maximum Crisis. This is where it happens. This is where we pull something big, right? We pull Ash Blossom Secret Rare. It's gonna happen. Phantasmal Spiral Powers. We have Spiral Crash. Artifact Vajra. We got the Cobalt Sparrow. Zodiac Cataroast. Breakaway, like, uh, what's her name? Kelly Clarkson. We have the Perform Mobile. Oh, and an Ultra Rare. Majesty Maiden, the true Draco Slayer. We have finally pulled something. Second Ultra of the video, or at least foil you know that's not guaranteed time to roll the die come on give us something good a one okay stream victory actually not bad i didn't really order them from like best to worst i just kind of did it at random stream victory is pretty nice let's see if we can get that tour guide secret rare if we get any foil out of here i need to make sure that i don't miss one like last time we will continue to open vintage packs Whew, yeah tg catapult dragon scarlet security oh ruxin special right off the bat jar turtle one of the creepiest looking cards out there jar turtle very weird Morstronic Landtron, we have TG1EM1, Mental Seeker, he's seeking the mental. 
TG Power Gladiator. Are we going to get a foil out of here? Chaos Infinity. Is that a rare? I think it's a rare. And Mech Time Blaster. I think if you get a rare, you don't get a foil in those. I can't remember because those are really, really old. All right. We are putting a Shadow Specters in that's place. Uh, pretty cool um, card you can get out of there. I really like the... Uh, what is that guy's called? I really like the Divine Knight guy out of there. All right, Maximum Crisis. We got back-to-back -back of these because, I mean, it, this worked last time. Let's try it again. Let's see if we can pull another Ultra or an Ash Blossom. That'd be amazing. Speedroid, Malicious Magnet, Ghost Beef, one of the funniest cards. The Ghost of Christmas Dinner. Woo! Zodiac Hammer Kong. Breakaway, Kelly Clarkson. We got the Double Resonator. Anakuju. We got the Formal Pal Sky Magician and Sylvan Princess Sprite. That's a super rare. Nothing crazy there. And Gift Exchange. All right. Two total foils or at least, uh, you know, leveled up foils here. We want to open more vintage packs. Let's go Battles of Chaos. You can do this one, two, three. A little special there. We have a Smoke Mosquito, the Mad Hacker. No Super Rux and Specials today. I will say that. We have had some Rux and Specials, though. Into the line with the Pog. Brand of Disciple. The Nowu Ares of the Vernal Dragon. Onibaba, no Nibar, <laughs> Onibimaru, Soul Sleeper. There we go. And a Dragon Bite. I remember this being such a bad card, but hey, it's a foil. That's not bad. And an imprudent in intrusion. Okay, yeah. Well, at least we got something. So we get to open a vintage pack. That's a plus. Time to roll the die once again. A six. Okay, we will be opening Magic ruler and original pack let's see if we can pull a foil out of here original print you can tell check out that old konami logo from 2002 they changed it to 2003 will we pull a blue eyes team dragon one two three four is the pack trick we have darkness approaches these feel great the old school cards koto dama the october sir very nice hungry burger you guys hear about hungry burger support yeah, this card's going up. It's going to be like 100, but no, I'm just kidding. I don't I doubt they use the regular one, but maybe they do. More Soldier, very cool. And Hungry Burger support is real. Also, there's a the hamburger recipe, same pack. That is an amazing ha hamburger pack. We have a Psychic Kappa. It might be the next one. Here we go. Is it a foil? No, it's the next one. Come on, Blue Eyes Toon Dragon. Let's go do this. Oh, an ultra rare mega morph. Let's go. Another ultra rare. So that means that we are opening another vintage pack. Mega morph, a pretty crazy card back in the day. There's a lot of fun stuff you could do with it. Okay, that's a nice pull. Probably our best of the video for sure. All right, we are replacing that with a power of the duelist unlimited pack. And now we will roll again for another vintage pack. Oh, okay. Went off screen. Let's do that again. Four. Okay. Dimension of Chaos. One of our favorite packs. Scarlight Red Dragon R2. I pulled it many, many times over the course of my uh, my channel. Four times, I think. Exactly. Two for me. Two for a, a viewer. One, two, three. Let's do that. We have Super Every Samurai Soul Horns. Dark Contract with Errors. Dark Doctor Frankenderp. We have Perform Page. Form Age. Mirror Conductor. I'm struggling. Suffer Reborn. So many different eras. A lot of different cards. It's just a lot of things that are hard to say. Okay. Super Every Samurai Drum. We have a Super Samurai Cavalry of Reptier. And... Gradle Impact. So no foil. That was not a guaranteed foil back then. Actually, the last set before there were guaranteed foils. We are going to replace that with a Photon Shockwave pack. All right, back to our regular pack. So we have opened a few vintage packs now. I think four, something like that. Let's see what we can get out of Battles of Chaos. We got to do our special pack trick. Can we get the Dark Magician? So far, this has been our, our lucky one, the, the Battles of Chaos. Smile Potion, Ghost Trick Retreat, the Epsilon, the Magnet Warrior. I don't even remember that one. Darton, the Mechanical Monstrosity, the Leaf Place Palace. We've got the Libromancer Super and the Great Double Casted Caster. Man, these really are tongue twisters. Now we've got Synchro Storm. Time to pull the Baron before the reprint. Let's do this. It's Baron time, baby. We have Unknown Synchron. We have Speedroid Marble, Tornado Dragon. Oh, and a Sage, a Sage, a Swag, a Deflora. I don't know how to say that, but that is definitely not guaranteed. Ultra rare. We'll take that. Synchro Storm coming in clutch. Here we go. Oh, dang it. I can't roll right. Oh, here we go. Oh, another six. Power of the Duelist. Unlimited. Here we go. Can we get that unlimited Dark Neos? That unlimited Chimera Tech Over Dragon? Let's do it. Ultimate rare. Vintage packs are being open. We're definitely getting some redemption today for last time. One, two, three, four. Started slow. But we've heated up. We got a Bite Lawn, Destiny Mirage. Let's get something good. We've opened a lot of Power of the Duelist, but I'm still looking for that Chimera Tech for my collection. Even Unlimited, I'd take it. Crystal's Dolphin, Black Terra, and a Neospatian Dark Panther. These things are loaded. Another foil. The Vintage Packs are really, they're really snowballing and opening a lot of packs. Okay, Replacement Primal Origin First Edition. Here we go. Let's see what we can get. 
a five legacy of darkness another old school the last one that we did old school the magic ruler had a foil in it let's see if this one does yada and judge the fair lily i don't know if it's a hobby or retail but either one would be insane even an unlimited so let's see if we can do it one two three four here we go is it another foil out of a vintage pack illusory gentlemen we got the legendary ocean robo yaru we've got a fiend comedian the throw stone unit spring of rebirth super robo yaru Bark of Dark Ruler and a Magic Reflector. So we're finally ending the Vintage Pack train, but don't worry, still a lot of packs to open. I say a lot, there's four left, but you know, that's a decent amount. Maybe we could pull something here. Let's go. We Last time, Rage Rock came through. Mechlord Fortress, Genzo, and Mechlord Emperor Skiel and a Wild Monster appears. All right, nothing crazy in that one. All right, Cyberdark Impact taking its spot. We have three packs to go. I forgot to replace that last time. Battles of Chaos. Let's go. I think it's the last Battles of Chaos. Maybe one more. One, two, three. Let's get a Dark Magician here. We have the Doll Monster, Miss Macon. We have Maple Maiden, Smoke Mosquito, Epsilon, Kaiza, Noru, Clear New World, the Emba Magnon, and a DDD Headhunt. So nothing in that one. Two packs to go. Legendary Duel Synchro Storm. Can you come in clutch again? I mean, last time you came in clutch, we have no Noble Knight Joan, the Tornado Road. Why did I just say Road? It has a dragon. I don't know where that came from. Oh, a super rare Clear Ring Synchro. Guess what, guys? In those Legendary Duelists, supers are not guaranteed. So we're rolling. All right, we are rolling on the second to last pack. What will we get this time? A three Cross Souls. We rolled three a couple of times. Cross Souls. Will you have a Clear Wing Synchro? Dragon, let's go. Let's see if we can pull an ultimate rare or a ghost rare. First off, Performal Pal Spring Goose, Ritual Beast Tamer, Zephramgla. We have the Giga Gloves, Despot 004, Infernoid, Formal Foul Blizzard Draw. We got the Pendulum Riser, the Ritual Beast Tamer, Zephra Windy, and UA Signing Deal. No foil in that one. All right, we tried on the Cross Souls. And we do have a backup Cross Souls that we're going to put in there. Our final pack, if we don't pull a foil. If we do pull a foil, it could go on infinitely until we stop pulling, you know, non-guaranteed foils. Let's see what we can do. Three Battles of Chaos. Could have two more Vintage Packs if we get the Dark Magician and a foil. Maple Maiden, I would love the Dark Magician. Smorg, Ogdoidic, Ruxin Special. It's been a while since one of those. Ghost Trick Retreat, Skilled Brown Magician. It's like Radagast, Doll Happiness. Neroy, I think this is the foil. XD's combined to super and Ghost Trick Festival. All right, okay. It was a good opening. We opened a good amount of vintage packs. Actually had some decent pulls and old school ultra rare pull was pretty awesome. And if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content like this. Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Daxer, JT Show, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, Dizzy, Flexi Boy, Hoppus, Choice 333, Micycle, James Jantz, TCG Truster Cards, America Deutscher, Supreme, Sage 21, Frankie Martinez, Nana Tai Show, Ian Moose, Junior Barding, Mimic Gecko, Shadowfall, and Thomas McLean. Thank you guys for supporting the channel and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.